Hi kids. Welcome to the channel Prizzling Treasures. Let's get into today's story. Once upon a time, a tiger was caught in a cage. He tried to get out through the bars, but he could not. He growled loudly in anger when he failed. By chance, a villager named Arjun was passing through a forest when he came across a tiger caught in a trap. Oh my lord, please help me out of this cage, called the tiger to the Arjun. Oh no, my friend, replied Arjun. If I did so, you would kill me and eat me. The tiger swore to not kill him and promised he would be Arjun's slave for his entire life. Listening to the tiger plead, Arjun's heart melted and he released the tiger from the trap. The tiger immediately pounced on Arjun and said, What a fool you are! What is to prevent my eating you now? After being locked up in the cage for so long, I am just terribly hungry. Arjun pleaded for his life. Wait, I have an idea. Let's ask the first three things that we find nearby whether you should eat me or let me live. The tiger agreed. Seeing a holy fig tree nearby, Arjun first asked the tree what it thought, hoping the tree would reply kindly that the tiger should let Arjun live. But instead, the tree said, I give shelter to all who pass by, yet humans tear down my branches for firewood. You are a fool to expect gratitude, replied the tree. Disappointed, Arjun turned to a buffalo. Dear buffalo, please help me. Please, please tell this tiger to let me live. After all, I freed him from the cage in which he was locked up. The buffalo replied in a loud voice, Look at me. I give humans milk and all they feed me is dry grass. Now that I have run dry, they tie me to a yoke and make me work from morning to night. You are a fool to expect gratitude. Finally, the tiger and Arjun saw a jackal passing by and told him the entire story. How very confusing, replied the jackal, shaking his head. You were in the cage and the tiger came walking by. Your story does not make any sense. Could you please tell me again? So Arjun told it all over again. But the jackal shook his head in a distracted sort of way. I do not understand. The cage was in the tiger and you came walking by. It's, it is very strange, said the jackal sadly. As it all seems to go in one ear and out the other, I'll do one thing. I will go to the place where it all happened and then perhaps I shall be able to give my opinion. So Arjun and Jackal returned to the cage where the tiger was waiting for Arjun sharpening his teeth and claws. Looking at Arjun, the tiger said, Let me begin my dinner. Give me five minutes, my lord, Arjun begged. In order that I may explain matters to the jackal here, since he doesn't understand. The tiger agreed and Arjun began the whole story over again, not missing a single detail, taking as long as possible to retell the story. Oh, my poor brain! My poor brain! cried the jackal, wringing its paws. Let me see, how did it all begin? Arjun, you were in the cage and tiger came walking by. What a fool you are, the tiger exclaimed. I was in the cage and Arjun came walking by. Of course, my dear tiger, replied the jackal. I was in the cage and you came walking by. Wait, wait, but how is that possible? I was not in any cage. The tiger was now getting impatient as he was very hungry. In anger at the jackal's stupidity, Tiger said, I'll make you understand. Look here, I'm the tiger. Yes, my lord. And that is Arjun. 
Yes, my lord. And that is the cage. Yes, my lord. He jumped in the cage and said, "Look, I was in the cage like this." And Arjun came walking by. Now do you understand? Perfectly. Grinned the jackal as he cunningly shut the door of the cage. And that's the story of how the jackal helped Arjun escape from the tiger. Grateful for the jackal's wisdom, Arjun went on his way, leaving the ungrateful tiger to its fate. Glad you tuned in. Love the story? Smash that thumbs up, leaving your cool comments. Subscribe and share with your squad. More curious? Hit the magical bell button. See you soon with another exciting tale. Bye bye.